For as long as humans have watched the skies, we've imagined a simple solution to a cosmic threat. If an asteroid were ever on a collision course with Earth, why not just blow it up? It sounds decisive, powerful, but in space things are rarely simple. Asteroids are not solid cannonballs. Most are fractured, porous worlds, more like loosely held rubble piles than solid rock. Detonating a nuclear device nearby would not necessarily destroy them. Instead, it could make the problem far worse. A blast might shatter the asteroid into multiple large fragments, each still travelling at tens of thousands of kilometres per hour, and still aimed at Earth. One impact becomes many. There is also the matter of timing. Nuclear deflection only works if we act years or even decades in advance. At close range, a nuclear explosion cannot push an asteroid out of the way, only disrupt it. And disruption is unpredictable. Modern planetary defense focuses on something far subtler. In 2022, NASA deliberately crashed a spacecraft into a small asteroid moonlet. The mission, known as DART, proved that even a tiny, well-timed nudge can change an asteroid's orbit. No explosion. No fragments. Just physics applied patiently. Nuclear devices are still studied as a last resort. Not to destroy an asteroid, but to gently alter its path by vaporizing material from its surface, creating a slow, controlled push. Even then, the risks are enormous. So the real defense of Earth is not brute force. It is early detection, careful measurement and quiet intervention, long before danger becomes inevitable. Because in space, the goal is not to win dramatically, but to avoid disaster entirely. Join us, won't you? A simple tap on subscribe and we shall explore the solar system together.